Hey loves, welcome to my channel. This is the mixed edition. So today guys, we are going to be covering the new Bridgerton collection collab with Bath and Body Works. So let's get into it. So for those of you who don't even know what Bridgerton is, this is a very popular series on Netflix written by Shonda Rhimes, honey. Don't forget to put that name in here. She is the creator of some of the biggest shows like Scandal and How to Get Away with Murder. So you know when I seen the collab pop up, baby, I was so excited to get my hands on this release. I'm super proud of Shonda and all the things that she has done and accomplished. I hope and pray that she is getting a coin off of this collab, okay? Um, but anyways, I wanted to support her creative intellectual property because without that, we wouldn't be having the collab uh, with Bath and Body Works. So if you guys haven't seen the series on Netflix, I advise you to catch up if it's on. I think it has two seasons. The first season was pretty groundbreaking. It's cinematic storytelling of mid-century era kings and queens, princesses, uh, princes, lords, and it has a unique spin because it has a lot of interracial and biracial types of stories and storylines. So it's really nice to kind of see all groups of people being represented in that era. And Shonda Rhimes did a wonderful job storytelling and incorporating uh, all of those different cultures into uh, this drama series on Netflix. So it has season one and season two out. Season one is by far my favorite, is groundbreaking for all the reasons that I just mentioned. And I believe season three is upcoming. So I guess they're doing a collab to kind of, you know, get ready for the season, okay? So speaking of getting ready for the season, if you guys are familiar with Bridgerton, then you already know diamond of the season okay diamond of the season if you guys don't know like i said we have queens and lords and all this other type of stuff um every spring season or whatever i think it is they choose the most upcoming eligible like queen and or a potential queenship these girls are probably like 16 17 like they're young and the queen she picks a diamond for that season and she is like the one that all the suitors all the potential uh lords and kings and princes like she is that one that they are like all eyes on her so anyways enough about the show because I can go on and on about the show. Um, Bath & Body Works is having a two-day exclusive early release in store of their collab uh, with Bridgerton. Yesterday, I went into the store and I had to get my hands on this, okay? Because they saying only two days. And we already know that this is going to be a limited collection. So I had to get my hands on it. So be sure to check my short and for those of you who watched my last Bath & Body Works haul, don't forget to enter the giveaway. It's still going on. Just subscribe, like the video, like the post, comment your IG, you're entered. So guys, we are about to see what we done picked up. So in the collection, they released body care, candles, all the things. So I'm about to show you. I picked up the body wash the body lotion I picked up the body cream I picked up the fine fragrance mist and I picked up the cleansing gel hand soap 
So guys, I have several backups of each item. I'm sad because I didn't pick up more. I might, I, there's still time for me to pick up some, so I might still do that. I only have two of the body washes, two of the body creams, and two of the body lotions. I only have one in the hand soap. It's just gonna go by so fast, so I didn't see a need for me to like really go crazy for these. But they are $3.95 at the timing of this video. So $4, yeah, you could pick up a lot of these. But I wasn't impressed to kind of get these. I wash my hands all day, every day so much that this is just going to fly by. So it's no need to me like breaking myself to try to uh, pick that up. So I kind of wanted to pick it up and what really mattered. So I got, um, how many is this? Five or six of these fine fragrance mists but I need to go back and pick up some more body creams and uh, the shower gels. Now next guys, let's get into the packaging, okay? I, I think they nailed it. I really do. I love the col color combinations and the color contrast. You have the royal gold and you know, with the black and the white and the bumblebee, I think they could have had a little bit more sparkly, more shimmery, because it is the diamond, okay? The season, the diamond season, they could have had it a little bit more sparkly, but the sparkle is in the scent. We can get into that in a second. But yes, guys, I think they did a really good job on the packaging. I love the color contrast. And specifically on the Fine Fragrance Mist, they did a different version of the top. Almost reflective of a diamond. So it's just not the flat. I have one here. It's not just the regular flat tops that they have on their regular Fine Fragrance Mist. They um, have it grommety. They have a like bezeled design. On the top which I love that because it kind of looks like a diamond yes shine bright like a diamond and it has it has embossed on the top bath and body works I know you guys are not gonna be able to see it but overall guys I love the packaging I love the color choices I love how they're using the contrasting colors it's 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 nice it's solid it is solid for sure now last but not least guys and most importantly of course let's get into how it smells okay so the notes of the diamond of the season bridgerton collection is sparkling peach spring daffodil and radiant jasmine guys it smells so good Ciao okay because we in our diamond season okay we trying to get chills oh i forgot i'm already chills but <laughs> and if he act up we gotta keep him on his toes guys i love this scent oh my god they did such a good job they did such a good job that sparkling peach and that radiant I don't know how they're capturing like radiance but you can just it smells like i'm trying to depict it they did such a good job making a connection a mood setting fragrance to the series like you feel royal you feel like you're going to a ball and you're drinking on sparkling peach champagne and the champagne is like really refined is more boozy it's not like fruity fruity but you still get that essence of being like in a peach garden or something like that let me set the scene for you guys it's like you are going to a ball at a huge mansion and this mansion has tons of property tons of land and they have like the indoor outdoor type of setting and in the outdoors, they have like 
water ponds and they have daffodils growing in the garden and they have peaches and jasmine you know they have like an indoor outdoor garden in the indoor setting they have the peaches growing and then the outdoor they have the jasmines and imagine going into a ballroom and you are surrounded by the indoor outdoor garden and you're underneath beautiful chandeliers so everything is sparkling, ref reflective, bright. You have the florals coming in and you're drinking on some sparkling champagne, some white peach sparkling champagne, and you have a centerfold of jasmines on, this, on the centerpiece of the table. It's giving guys I love this they did a bang-up job on this okay it doesn't it doesn't last long it, it's super bright it's super light it's super sparkly and champagne -y, and I love champagne champagne rose jasmine those are certainly some of my favorite notes so to have sparkling peach but it's almost like champagne -y. it's almost like boozy this smells lovely guys this is great for spring and i think they did an excellent job with encapsulating a scent that can transport you or make you feel connected to the show and i hope that depiction that i gave was spot on because i really could see that like they did an excellent job. I love this. So just off the scent alone, even if you don't know anything about Bridgerton, you don't know anything about the Netflix series, the show, Shonda Rhimes, the scent alone is just worth going to go try out and putting your nose on. So, okay, guys, let me get out of here because just spraying that all over again, I got to go get my hands on some more of this stuff. Love you guys down. Mwah, mwah, mwah.